happened four days ago in Baghdad. 51 people were killed and 107 others were wounded in a suicide attack that targeted Shiite pilgrims. That's the devastating reality of Iraq today, a country of escalating violence where, according to the UN, 800 people were killed in August alone. We've also seen what can only be described as a brutal massacre at Camp Ashraf, with 52 unarmed people killed and seven taken hostages by Iraqi forces. The responsibility for these attacks lies not just with the various sectarian murder gangs, but also with those who cheer cheerled and actually implemented the war and occupation of Iraq. They had no qualms about imposing a puppet regime to continue the repression and inequality, and they had no qualms about promoting sectarian division, from imposing a parliament along, along ethnic lines to arming sectarian death squads. Imperialism and capitalism have demonstrated they are fundamentally incapable of resolving the problems of sectarian violence. What is needed is a powerful united movement of the Iraqi working class which can undermine the sectarian forces and use the massive wealth in Iraq to build a social society free from poverty and division. Thank you.